Welcome to Dynamics of YouTube channel. So today I'm going to give you a thoughtful revision on a message by Apostle Chucho Selman. In this podcast, Apostle Selman started by stressing the importance of the law of process, noting that many fail because they skip necessary steps, hoping to achieve results immediately. So they will be looking at the core message, emphasizing that delay are often not set back but crucial preparation period. Apostle also uses the example of Jesus who prepared for 30 years for a ministry, lasting only for three and a half years to illustrate the necessity of patience and readiness. So, so the conclusion, Apostle also encourages the audience to appreciate the handwork and process behind success, highlighting how enduring these steps build rest for one save and other who have achieved greatness through perseverance so embrace every stage of your journey understand that each step prepare you for a greater responsibility for success remember for for every success there is a process so please make sure you watch this video from beginning to end and make sure you like and share and also subscribe to our youtube channel and turn on the notification button thank you the law of process is the reason why many people become failures in life because we live in a generation where we like results without process. We love it when we arrive even before we start the journey. And many times we call process delay. I'm here to give you an orientation that not everything that looks like delay is delay. Are we together? At age 12, Jesus Christ was at the temple already and for the next 18 years we never hear anything about jesus again for 18 years he's silent what was he doing for 18 years the next time we hear about jesus he's 30 years old coming to jordan to be baptized of john the baptist now why did jesus christ wait 30 years to do a ministry of three and a half years three and a half years was the lifespan of his ministry but he prepared for 30 years let me teach you something about life you must be tested and proven before you are honored you must be tested and proven before you are honored hmm. very powerful teaching no matter how you pray no matter how you fast it will never jump the law of process you must be tested you must be proven to be honored now let me tell you this let me use an example with our great father in the Lord Papa Iya Deboe did you know that today he represents the face of God and the voice of God to a generation especially the generation of our parents no matter how anointed I am today even if I cut somebody's head and fix it back the elderly people 50 60 70 years will not be impressed to come and demand my grace it's not been tested that far to command their loyalty uh, do you understand what i'm teaching you yes if i heal the sick today and i cast out devils an old woman will only look at me and be impressed that her son is knowing god early but she will quickly go back to be blessed where she has been tested or has been tested and proven to work many times we want the loyalty of men even as men of god we want them to believe the word of god upon our mouth just because the content of our information is accurate you will need more than that you will need to be vetted and tested and approved by a generation before you become the face of God to that generation it will take a long time let me tell you this there are many people today who are great anointed blessed but a generation will never hear them because they have not been vetted and they have not been tested Paul a man approved of God approved of God approved of God 
the law of process is a very painful one but let me tell you this when you subscribe to the law of process your success becomes stable because there is a track record of growth are we together now run away from any success that does not have a history of growth it will not last the law of process it takes time to succeed it takes time to be great it takes time to manifest it takes time for the heart of men to be open towards you pass through it go through the law of process that's what you are going through right now the law of process like i said yesterday some of you in the years to come you will be the ones holding this mic and teaching in your conference and teaching with power but if you desire that level now you are only wasting your time you can only see it in your dreams and your visions the law of process you will be vetted and approved by both god and men and you will be authorized to also stand and eat with the great this will help you to draw the line between faith and foolishness faith is not foolishness give us this day our daily bread not give us tomorrow's bread today there is an allocation for today lord i am content with today's bread when i get to tomorrow i will appreciate tomorrow's bread when i ask for tomorrow's bread today something is wrong the law James chapter 1. James chapter 1. We'll read from verse 3. The book of James chapter 1. Is it projected? From verse 3. James 1. Verse 3. Let's start from 2. James 1 two it says my brethren read with me one to read my brethren aha uh -huh. count it all joy when you fall into diverse temptations knowing this there is an information he wants you to know what is the information that the trying of your faith work at patience if you have never cried how are you going to wipe the tears of those who cry there are people who are too innocent to be great. If you have never failed, how do you lift those who fail? There are times that my brothers and my sisters, you will pass through the same thing you will be delivering others from. Why? So that you will build compassion. Compassion is the ability to be touched with the feelings of other people's infirmity. You need compassion you need compassion to love you need compassion to be there for people you need compassion to be able to minister the life and the power of God and sometimes if you go through things in life now some of you your background is what was preparing you for your destiny you went through a background without a father without a mother you had to work while you are schooling you know the pain so when God says prophesy increase to people, you are not just speaking as a man of God, you are speaking with a heart of compassion. Are we together? The law of process helps you appreciate your success and it helps you to honor successful people. When success comes too cheap, you do not place value on it is the reason why today we 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 insult wealthy people we insult successful people the moment you see someone blessed you say he's just lucky he's just a lucky man of god she's just a lucky woman of god he's just a lucky this and that but when you pass through the law of process you will have a lot of regard 